Why pick Genji over other ass? I see no point. He is the best finisher in the game, Gojira. The best finisher in the game. You do need some other damage. But if someone is getting away with low health... Genji's your man. Hooray! Hooray, Garniton! Thanks for the seven months resub. I have seen your mum in Amsterdam. That's possible. My aunt lives there. Could be visiting. I hope you said hi. Um, because uh, she was at WCG 2008. A number of people recognized her there from uh, Cassandra's blog pictures and so on and so forth. All right, first quick match with Genji. I need healing. We start in 10 seconds. Five, four, three. First quick match with Genji. And pretty cool matchup. Let's see if Zero Two can outrun me. Oh, yes. My skill speaks for itself. Very well. Uh, I will get Swift as the wind. We'll try to play as. Legit as a build as possible. And we'll try to play the map as well. No more silly shigenji -ness. Wave clearing in style. But I have no escape right now. We'll rotate safely here. Uh, Salad Fork and Raz JK, thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome to the stream. Symbiote implanted. You augmented. Nice in the Ming skin, new skin. It's so cool when he says again, it's like those martial artist trainers, you know? It's like again, again. Wax on, wax off. Daniel san. Okay, leave me, uh, Lily. Okay, so um, Abathur should be soaking this bot, actually. Plan. It's not my job. I will stay here. I'm going to go Shuriken Mastery. My is His body is top to soak the top, and he should be symbioting bottom if he judges that's the right thing to do. I'll leave it to him. I know yeah, Tanke is a pretty good player. So I'm going to go top now instead. Of course he wants to play it safe for Zeratul. You're not unstoppable during jump, so don't use it as a last ditch escape. When the opponent has stuns or displacement, you'll get knocked out. You'll land up where you were. The best wave clear is this, but it's also your escape. Overall, his wave clear is really weak. You cannot even fully wave clear a wave in 8 seconds. Not even in 8, and he has to use a lot of abilities. This hero must die. Oh yeah! Say Kuso? What's Kuso? This is how stutter stepping looks like with Genji. 
There's always a small little stop. You can't non-stop walk like a, you know, like a tracer could or would. Ariel got buffed. She now does more damage with auto attacks and with Qs. Okay, my level 7 talent. I'm going to go for what? Periodically dodge basic attacks is really good against Zeratul. It's okay against the others, but mostly Zera. Uh, then I can get spell armor, which is really good against almost everyone, but it's after a jump. So I would need to use it as an engage, which I may or may not. Deflect cool and it's okay. Shield after the effect ends is okay. I'm going to go with dodge this time. I have never taken it yet. I want to see what it's like. I have currently one charge. As you can see, bottom left, this thing. Very dynamic display when you have more charges as well. Easy peasy finishing. That's Genji for you. No self-sustain to speak of. Fairly low health pool. But very mobile. Great finisher. And he has no cloak. Thank God. Or I might not have liked him. Of course, stupidity will kill you every time. Going to go for the fountain. The difference between Genji and Tracer is huge. Uh, Tracer can literally attack while moving. Genji cannot. He has a small stop. He has a very long distance, triple spitting, spammable ability. Tracer does not. Sequences augmented. And uh, Tracer has a recall, and he has a forward dash, which is kind of the opposite. Uh, I will get X Strike. That Uther though. He's out of my reach. Leaving, that face when leaving is out of your reach. How do you click the healing well and have it auto path back? That's with shift command bonuses. Hold down shift, give two commands. Like this, hold down shift, press another, press another. You take your hands off the keyboard and mouse and it will follow the itinerary. Just hold down shift. It's a basic Blizzard RTS mechanic that basically all RTSs have it. But as a mobile player, as a new player, you may not necessarily know. Trying to do actually let's not do the boss. Sequences augmented. And one cool thing about the Q, the shurikens, is that you can start the together cooldown of Q and then wait eleven seconds till the cooldown is almost back like this. And you do one, two, three, four, five. And normally you have only three charges, so having that many charges in a row is actually pretty cool. If you want to get good at stutter stepping with a hero, I fully recommend you to close your eyes, attack a minion wave, and just listen. That's the amount of time you're allowed to move in between. If it sounds longer, you've stepped too much. That's why sound is so important in this game. Yeah! 
nice. Uh, I'll go for low like water. Good for. I feel like I'm better at stutter stepping already, just by closing my eyes. Such a ninja! What if you're deaf? If you're deaf, you have to do it visually. If you're deaf, you have to do it visually. <laughs> How could you know my answer? My blade never dulls. I'm really liking Genji so far. on that one wait for it <laughs> find the orb Yeah, well, that's gonna happen on ladder. Good luck, guys. So this is the range of E, just in case you haven't seen that indicator yet. <laughs> you try to run for me? Nope. Boldly done. How close do you need to be to a target to get all your cues? I think pretty close. Almost melee or melee. Symbiote implanted. You augmented. Um Final Cut, no steady blade. It's pretty good. Deflect. Let's try reflect. This is my time. I have two Q cooldowns, so I wait until the end of it and then I'll use them all. Kind of. Or not. Uh, I still don't have the Q quest, which is pretty insane after all this time. out of here or not hearthstone time uther wave clear alt <laughs> i mean it's quick match on the beta you know things is gonna happen soon they shall bask in my glory that's a trick you can do which uh, basically all heroes with an immediate dash medif portal tracer zeratul uh you can uh, still have the Hall of Storms effect of being mounted, being insta-mountable. 
even after you teleport out of it. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Well, it was Avatar on me, I was two levels higher, she also wasn't casting any abilities. Still pretty nice. He kills people in style, man. Mayhem. Organism Abathur. Yay. I knew you could do it. Oh, he just interrupted my jump with Wave of Force. Symbiote implanted. Yeah, so it's very important that you see his um, uh, you see his auto attack as an actual Rainer style auto attack, where you listen to it, you you, know, you do it on the beat, rather than thinking like, okay, it's like Tracer. If you do think that and you can keep attacking, you're going to cancel a lot of your own attack animations or not auto attack enough. Epic. Nice. First game of Genji in quick match with probably the most valid build we've done yet. I'll show it to you now. New Vala skin. Yeah, we're going to look a bit more at the skins, but let's just take a look at the loot chest. Uh, let's just take a quick look at... Um, uh, invite request failed? Okay, well, we'll try later. Quick look at the talents. We've got a lot of kills, which is probably what you would expect from Genji. Uh, you know, good Genjis in the ideal situations. Get the kills, not necessarily the highest hero damage. That would be weird, but kills because he's a finisher. The build I had was Swiftest. The Wind, Shuriken Mastery, Dodge, X-Strike, Flow Like Water, and Reflect. Oh, we're killing them all behind the gate. Oh, yeah. Impressive. <laughs> you can do that! <laughs> you can jump in and then eat! My blade to kill someone! And there's no tower zone! Look at this, I'll just show you one more time! <laughs> yes! A map of my liking! You can now BM without getting killed! <laughs> 